Randolph County Infirmary might be the scariest location I've been to yet. Randolph was previously known as a poorhouse, a farm, a house or a home, and just a helping center. There's murder, there's suicide, there are stories of people living their whole life in this building. People that are trapped, that they can't leave, they're stuck in this building. People that go insane, and it just leads for a huge mystery. Randolph was a location that took people in, and it led to where the infirmary really has most of those stories. Where people would be prisoned down in the basement, trapped, locked away in cells having it split in between a men's side and a woman's side. So many stories happen in this building where there's murders, there's suicide, multiple different situations. What these people were able to do at the time was work other than the people that were stuck in the infirmary. What they had to do was live their life away trapped between four walls. Randolph also houses multiple spirits going across from females to men to something demonic in the basement. This demonic creature looks at itself as something with tentacles, almost looking like an octopus figure that you see crawling around on the floors, that you see, that you hear making all of this banging noises, yelling at you, making you feel the most uncomfortable that you've ever felt in any location possible. Randolph has a lot of deeper history to it, and it's history that we don't know. And that's what I'm really interested in finding out here tonight. Will the spirits want to communicate with us? Will they want to tell us their story? Or will we potentially find something that is darker that lurks in the basement? Tonight we are filming at Randolph County Infirmary, a place that M has a lot of stories oh, and yeah. a lot of mystery to it. Mm -hmm. And I mean, it goes from murders to just simple deaths to just who knows, like everything that has happened here. There were a good handful of suicides in, in different ways and even one where we don't know if it was a suicide or not. Because um, this guy uh, fell out of the window and they don't know if he was pushed or not. So. And that's like the weird story. It's like, you know, was it a suicide? Was there people that were mad at him that pushed him out of this window? It is just up in the air. And it's like, we yeah. really don't know. And I mean, it goes down from a girl that was trapped in the basement that was just literally kept there for as long as I don't even yeah. know. But she took her own life. She literally put a broom up, leaned over, didn't even drop anyway, and she hung herself just by leaning over. That's how bad she wanted to take her life by being here in this place. What a horrible way to die. And so yeah, she was in her basically cell of a room. She she they didn't want her to like hurt herself, so um she didn't want her to hurt anyone around, and so she instead decided to take her own life by leaning against a broom a broom and that's what's wild and then you have others you know people that have been here and died here under the name doris she would cook meals she would keep her dolls and she stayed here for years until 70 years for 70, 70 years. years until she just died here now the really interesting thing is something that almost looks like what they call an octopus. Now, I don't really know, but what they say is that's more of like a darker spirit. And it's something that we actually haven't seen of a story in a little bit. Or is something gonna affect the investigation because of that? I yeah. don't know. Yeah, so this this thing that people have seen is supposed to have looked like an octopus. And it's basically your typical crawler, but in the form of an octopus. And that is known to be a very dark spirit here. Welcome to Randolph County Infirmary. Um, I don't know what to expect. Again, I really don't, I don't, but. All right, Em. We're just gonna have to find out, Let's like always. Let's get into it. All right, guys, so where we're gonna be starting right now is up in the attic. And this is where supposedly the judge is. All right, guys, right now we do have everything set up. And I mean, we are in the dark attic, Em. It is creepy. Um, what we have right now, it's going off like crazy, is the dead bow. We have cat balls layered out everywhere as well. I don't know where they're at. We have the music box on that desk, and that thing's not stopping. We also put a REM pod in case they want to communicate. We can go back in there. They just got to let us know by tapping that. But we also have this new device. And what this is, is it's pretty much just like an ovulus. It'll just sprout, it'll say the words just like any other device would with the uh, like spirit talker that you see us use. 
and uh, obvious that we do work with sometimes. So I've never used this device yet, and um, I'm definitely curious to see what it does. We can maximize the sensitivity, so we'll put that up to around 75% for now. And I guess what that does is it gives them a little bit of an easier time to yeah. communicate. I thought I just heard footsteps in there. Chris. Chris. Is your name Chris? Let's do one for yes, two for no. On the bell. Do you want to do that? One for yes, two for no. Yes. Okay. So is your name Chris? So what we'll do is leave this right here. Block. Block. Right. No. The name is not Chris. We do have a DR60 with us. So we can use this tonight. Yep. But okay. So is the judge up here? Are you the judge? Yes. No. 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 <laughs> it was like, no, 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 wait, no, I'm not. And it kept dinging it. All right, so you're not, you're not the judge. All right, no, not the judge. Um, and he's not Chris. Okay, were you a patient here? Yes. Take that is a yes. Yeah, okay. Yes. Did you die here? Yes. Yes. Okay. Did we, oh, okay. Sorry, do you want to go? No, I was going to say, are, are you a man? No. No. So you're a woman? Are you Doris? Oh, okay. So, are, so you're a woman? Are you neither? No, okay. All right, let's do this. One for man, two for female. We'll redo that. Can you redo that for me? One for man, two for female. Female. Ooh, okay. okay. So now I'll ask my question again. Oh, I did it again. Can, are you Doris? One for yes, two for no. Yes? This is Doris? No. no. Is your name Ida? Yes. yes. Oh. No. Do that again. Is your name Ida? Give us one ding if your name is Ida. Ida. So is it true that you passed away in your room? Ding, ding, ding. Ida, did you take your life? I'm sorry you felt the need to do that. We're very sorry about that. Are you able to leave? No. no. Oh. I'm oh, sorry. I feel so strange. What do you mean? I don't know. I just feel weird. Um, I literally have to turn this on for a second. I feel that strange right now. Really? Like something just feels off. Well, I mean, if this is Ida talking to us, she's trying to tell us that she is stuck here and she does not like it. No, I know. I'm very sorry, Ida. You know what? I just, Ida, can you please join us right here? And yeah. was that a no? Ida, what this can do, this device right here can pick up your voice. And what I would really like to do is hear from you. We mean no disrespect to you, Ida. I just want to start off by saying that. My name's Tyler. My name is Marina. And we're here to learn from you. We're here to get your story. So I don't want you to be, feel like you need to be scared of us. And I'm not saying you are. I just want to let you know. But let's try this. And if you join us right here, so we don't have any interference with that bell, 
it's going to be the easiest way to pick up your voice. Yep. So yeah, if you have anything to say to us or if you could answer our questions, you can just say it into this recorder and then we'll be able to hear you hopefully. No. Let's Let's try it. Ida, we're going to try it. We're going to try it. Wait, do you want to turn off the bell first? No, no, no. no? Let's, let's leave it on for now. Ida, I'm going to ask quickly just to get your voice. If you don't want to use this recorder, please tell me no. And this will be the only question I'm asking, by the way. And then if you say no, we'll respect that. But, Ida, do you want to use this voice or use this device to hear your voice? I did hear that bang. That was a big bang. Okay. I, uh, I'm going to ask quickly just to get your voice. If you don't want to use this recorder, please tell me no. And this will be the only question I'm asking, by the way. And then if you say no, we'll respect that. But, Ida, do you want to use this voice or use this device to hear your voice? It sounds like I won't. It's like, I won't. I know. Okay. Well, Ida, we're going to respect that, okay? Hmm. Yes. Is there any other device that you can hit to let us know that you're here? Maybe walk in front of that desk right there. It's a music box. Or if you want to come in back of this room. There's a red light over here that will light up and make some noise if you touch it too. Ida, would we be able to talk to you more clear in your room? No. Do you not like to stay in your room? No. No. I mean, I wouldn't. I mean, she was trapped there. Away. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't want to stay in there either. Ida. Can you make it ding for how many spirits are up here? Six. Six. Seven. Well, it's gonna keep going, but it took a long pause after six. It just keeps going. It's just weird that it hasn't gone like this. That's true. Okay, Ida, so there's a lot, there are a lot of spirits here? Yes. Ida, can you, can you take a break from that for a second? <sighs> She's like, I'll take I did a second. I don't know. I have a feeling that this isn't Ida. I don't, I don't, think, I don't so. think this is Ida. No, 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 no. Who are we speaking to? No. Do you not want to say your name? No. no. Okay. Are you okay with us? being in this place. I, I can't, I don't even know what to go off I, of here with this either. now. Because also nothing, is, uh, nothing else is going off. I, I don't think that we're talking to Ida though. I don't think so either. Can you, can you talk, can you be real with us? Yes. Yes. I want to have an actual conversation with you. Can can you have an actual conversation with us? Okay. Are you acting like Ida right now? And it's okay. Yes. Okay. Thanks for being honest. Okay. The threes are what's getting me. 
Is there something that you want to say to us? No. Do you not want to talk? No. Okay. If you make it ring three times fast, we'll go downstairs right now. We'll leave the attic. Has to be three quick. Ding, ding, ding. <gasps> okay. All right. We're going to leave your space. All right. That was super strange. I mean. I, yeah, I definitely do not think that we were talking to Ida. I, think I don't think so either. I, I really don't. I think we were talking to something that was intrigued by us, but didn't want to answer questions. No. And so it pretended to be Ida because it's what we called out for. Yeah. I don't know. It was just getting super, super ring happy. So it's yeah. like, what was that about? I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's like, maybe it's just because it's an old attic, right? right? But it's just like, I don't know, something about it to where it was just, I don't know, super off settling, which is weird, but yeah, yeah. I just. It's definitely um, unsettling in here. So if we hear any words go off, I didn't turn off like that obvious thing in my bag. Okay. See, it just said something. What was that? I don't know. Oh. Two things? Now, it, now it's going off. No. <gasps> The kid here. Huh? The kid here yeah, named Noah. Noah. Yo. Hold on. We gotta take this back out here. Hold this. <laughs> what? Why is it just going on? Pencil. Noah, Ju my July Noah pencil? Look at that. It says Noah. So there is a kid named Noah here. Yeah. And I mean, is that where we go? Noah's room? I guess is so. That like, I mean, yeah, we could go to Noah's room next. I mean, that's what it said. It's like, because we wanted to work our way down, but it's like, if this is already going Noah. Well, Noah is, I believe, on the floor below, below us. So I think Noah's room is the next one. Noah's room is the next one? I think so. I think it's on the next floor. That's the men's building. All right, we're keeping we'll, we'll walk up. around, yeah. But, yeah, keep that out. Wow. Okay. Dude. <laughs> that was weird. said a name from here. That's That's so crazy. Cool. That is crazy. Began. Let's just. Yeah. What is going on? <gasps> <laughs> Providence. That's me. That's where I am. Carbon. Guys, Tyler's from Providence, Rhode Island. Mary. Larry. What? Larry. Mary. 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 Daddy. D Mary. Daddy. Mary. Daddy. Is, is so it like weird. Noah trying to talk? But like his parents? I don't know. All right, yeah, we definitely got to go to This is so strange. Next. Before we head to Noah's room, I had to come back. I had to make a phone call. I'm like, my anxiety at this place is like up here. We just took a break for a second because I'm like, I had to settle. I had to get back into the rhythm. And it's weird. I can't. Guys, right now, I can't explain it. But like something that was not on the forecast, it is storming so bad and you can hear it i mean the lightning right now it is insane and it's like whoa 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 that's like i don't know here we'll see if we can catch it but guys like i don't know what this is it's like geez i keep stopping myself this is like a conduit for spirits i already have so much anxiety inside of this house and right now, this is what I'm looking at. This is a huge storm. And I mean, I, I, there was nothing, nothing saying that there was anything like this. I'm not saying it is spiritual or something like that, but I mean, this is crazy. Jesus. I made a phone call, guys. The, one of the people that I know that's in the area, Clayton, um, he's gonna come join me and Em. I don't know what it is. I, it, it's just one of those spots I can't do alone. I'm gonna make, not alone, I'm with Em but not one of those spots to where it's like me and her. I'm looking over my shoulder. I need someone who knows this building. I don't get like this. And this building right here, it's spooky. I didn't think that inside this house was gonna get that. I mean, look at this guys. Talk about just downpouring. Insane. He should be here soon. He's that close. And 
We're gonna pick up the camera when Clayton gets here. He's actually here right now. All right, all right, let's get. Clayton! Oh, he's right here. Oh, out, 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 pull it out, pull it out. Dude. Dude. Dude, I am so happy that you were able to be close by, dude. Because honestly, you know this building, and dude, so far it has been freaky. I mean, all we've hit was the attic, and I can't explain what's going on. But dude, this was not These on the came forecast. came out of nowhere. Bro, this this like, has been here within like the blink of like five minutes. I'm dude, not even kidding. And like this, when I called you and stuff like that, this wasn't like this. You know no. what I mean? Because I updated them. But this was not like this, dude. This storm was not supposed to be here tonight. Good lord. And I mean, dude, the sound of it, the look of it, I mean, it's insane. Which I was telling them is a conduit for spirits. Exactly, yeah. Dude. I've had anxiety up the roof before getting here, trying to hold it back and just going up here. Dude, I had to turn the light on in the attic for me to even get through it without looking over my shoulder or anything like that. And now, with this storm being here, specifically even it's, more. It's gonna amp everything up. And that's what I'm nervous about, dude. You know this building, you know the ins and outs. Yep. That's why I figured you might be one of the best guys to contact I other than Jake that. and Noah and stuff like that. But we're gonna be filming with them on the next video, so yep. I'm like, you know, let's see what the difference that we can get. Let's but do it's this, like, bro. dude. Yeah. Hold, hold on, let's get inside, away from the rain. Guys, <laughs> guys <laughs> it's just getting worse nowhere. with just it getting closer. It's, dude. It's like, look at him, guys. This is, look at this. <laughs> look at this. Trench. Look at my freaking boots and my pants, and everything. That is insane. Dude. It's, it's like coming in and out with the rain, but it's just. Guys, this is insane. This came out of nowhere. It was so sunny earlier today, and now it is just absolute downpour. And every single time that there is a storm, it is a crazy night. Dude, every time. And I just want to update you, and it's a small update. We were up in the attic. Mm -hmm. We were talking to something that acted like Ida. Yep. Mm -hmm. And I just, we had, the, but we both had the same feeling like we didn't think it was Ida. Right. But then when we were packing up, closing up and stuff, it said Noah, it said something about mom and dad. So we're thinking next spot is Noah's room, just because I mean, yeah. what are the odds that it picks up a name on the device? And actually you let us borrow it. Yeah. So I appreciate that, Absolutely. thank you so much. Yeah. And um, yeah, guys, and that's how I knew Clayton was so close by. But um, dude, it's weird, this it's is a nice weird bro. feeling. I personally don't get like this on investigations. To be like this in this spot, that's what I was saying to Emma. No, we said it off you're camera. You're freaked out. We, I, I'm, I don't know why, but you are freaked out. And it's making me freaked out. Yeah. So, it's kind of worrying me too, bro. Uh, we've talked a lot. Like, this is like the first time really investigating together ever. Yeah. And I've never even, like, even on the phone, no, heard you dude, freaking out. I, like don't, this, bro. I so don't get this like nuts. this. <laughs> and it's like I'm smiling because, like, you guys know. And if there's anyone new watching, like, when I get like this, it's like that nervous smile. So, yeah. I think now it's going to be Noah's room. And we're just gonna see who wants to communicate, who wants to talk, and just let them kind of lead it. Yeah. The thing I'm nervous with, dude, you're dripping. It's so dude, it's, it, this is, it actually feels great, because it, it is hot like in here, bro. Look at all my hair, bro, that's crazy. Obviously, yeah. guys, I want to do this with just me and M so I know. bad. And it would have been a good video, just us, but also it's one of those things where it's like, if you do not feel good, for whatever reason, just trust your gut, because yeah. I'm sure that there's a reason why you feel like that. Yeah. So, and now we have Clayton. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> All right, now getting fully back into what is Randolph. All right, let's go to Noah's right. room. Noah's. Dude, this is just such a creepy vibe with these hallways. I'm gonna be real with you all. I've been here probably 10 times. This is one of the most weird, odd feelings I've ever had in this building. And really? I'm just saying that for your video. I've been here so many times and it actually, I'm starting to get a, like a ball in my chest. Like I do not have a good feeling in this building right now. I really do not. Dang dude. So Noah's room is gonna be back. I'm sorry, I got caught up. <laughs> I'm sorry, I got caught up talking. I am so sorry. It is right here. All right, right here. And this is <sighs> Noah's sanctuary. Why? I mean, so I feel fine. I mean, I'm getting <laughs> freaked out just from you guys, but I want to know why y'all are feeling weird. Because I'm, I'm like Tyler. I never get scared. I do some of the. I do. I go solo at places. Yeah. I just went in Edinburgh yeah. all by myself in Villisca. I don't ever get scared, but this is something about tonight is just off, oh. and I don't like it. I thought I just heard a fucking roar down the hall. A roar. A roar. <laughs> I thought I heard like a. Roar. Does that even make sense? Well, not in the sense of anything that I personally heard, but the thing, the entity in the basement that resides where it is, it has identified itself as beast. 
on the PS device. Dude, that's oh, what scares me, man. It's that like, that is the overall thing that I'm thinking about. So that entity feels very prominent tonight. It really does. Because usually, so I've been here like 10 plus times and when it's the entity's not out, you really feel the connection with the actual humans that were here. So All do the you women think that's actually, what I'm picking up on? Yeah. Because sure. there is nothing else in this building that will make you feel like that. And you know what's weird? I know the PS device is working for you all. It is not going to library right now. It will not stop processing. Yes. What? Yeah. It will not work. You can try turning it on and off again, but that is weird. It was working perfectly. I don't know. And it said Noah on it, right? Isn't that yeah. what you all said? Yeah, it said Noah. Noah. Yeah, no, this place does not feel good tonight, bro. <laughs> it does not feel good. Um, Noah, I know you like to go to bed early, but if there's any chance that you are here with us in your room tonight, can you make any of our devices go off? Or if you want, you can play with one of your toys, make it move or make any sounds with them. We welcome you to do that. That one right there. Loves that thing. I hope you remember me, me and you have grown a really good connection. Can you speak through this? You've used this device many, many times. Unless it's not Noah, if it's not Noah and someone else wants to speak, can you bang from the hall? Oh, I heard something. What'd you hear? A bang from either, I want to say like maybe downstairs or somewhere, but it, it was distant. Probably, maybe. But it, it was like a distant bang. I didn't even hear it. Make that noise a little bit louder for us. Here. Here, H-E-A-R. Like you just heard that, here. Did that thing have a really loud ring to it? Yeah, Okay. yeah. Whenever a word comes through, it's like the frequency that it's picking okay, up. Okay, because I heard that in my ear. Yep. Yeah, I, I think I heard you. Can you try a little bit louder or maybe even closer to us? Hey, Noah, if it's past your bedtime or you want us to leave your room, can you tell us or give us a sign? It's so hard for me with this rain now. I know. What if we just tried one of these? Try it, bro. Let's see if Noah, because usually I want to say this on live streams when we're here and I am talking to Noah, he will come through this device and literally say good night around 9.30, 9.45. Really? What and time is it just, now? It's like, it's like one o'clock in the morning. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, so he will literally tell us good night. It's his bedtime and he will stop communication. He's done. All right, well, let's try it. Noah. We got your name off of that device that's in Clayton's hand. Unless we are bothering you and you don't want to talk, can you say goodnight? Mm -hmm. Who's out in the hallway? If you're out in the hallway and you want to talk, please join us in Noah's room. Why is it that we're feeling like very off tonight? Why is that? I'm gonna stop this. Was that just behind you? Something? Yeah, it was on the desk. It was tapping on the, I didn't move. No, I, I know. Yeah, something tapped on the desk. Yeah. Here, let's listen back. And then yeah, back. let's see if we got something. No. I'm gonna do regular uh, speed.
I thought there was a response. Was no, we got your name off of Matt Devices in Clay and Sand. Yeah, we got your name off of Matt Devices in Clay and Sand. Unless we were bothering you and you don't want to talk and you think you're not. Mm. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. Did you know what I'm going to do? Oh, I went, mm-hmm. Uh, but there's something else other than me going, mm-hmm. Why is it that we're feeling like there is all night? Why is that? Yeah, nothing. Dang. Yeah, Noah might be asleep. Yeah. Because they've also described that entity, the really dark one, as the bad thing or the mean thing. And usually on night, solid. I don't know what that could mean. Solid. Solid. I don't know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn the sensitivity up just a tad. Just a tad. Here, I'll show the camera. I just turned it up yep. just a little bit. What was that? Whoa. What was that? It sounded like a woman's voice. Yes. And in my head this whole time, it's go to Doris's room. The one at the, like, her kitchen or her room down the hall? Her room down the hall. You wanna go down there? Dollar. Dollar. James. James. Dollar James. Peace. Peace. That, that woman's voice like sounded painful. Like that's the vibe I got from the Ambition. tone. Ambition. Now why is this thing going nuts? Every time I talk about this is what happened when we said that we were leaving um, the attic, all of a sudden, yeah, it just it picks up like up. crazy. Really? When yeah. we're like on the move. Yeah, as soon as we decide like, okay, maybe we go somewhere else, it's like, woo wait, and then like, starts up all this stuff. Wow. I'm gonna step, I'm gonna step out in the hallway with this real quick. <laughs> and see if any frequency or energy on this hallway can pick it up. There's anybody in the hallway, can you come this is and weird. on this device? It's like, so eerie, and I feel like something's like gonna build up and then happen but it's quiet right now. It's weird, I feel like from the start I've had some pull for Doris and I don't know why. I Is that hate what? being out that hallway by myself. <laughs> oh my God. Iron. Iron? I was just saying to her though, I feel like this weird pull to Doris. You wanna go down there? Yeah, I think so. Cause, I just, Cause there's two main I, locations that Doris really was, is that room and in the basement and the kitchen. In the basement. Harmonic. Okay. What if we stay out in the hallway for a minute? I'm fine with that, bro. You still want me to face this down the hallway? Huh? Um, unless we put it in Doris's room, actually, if we stay out here, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's true. I'll put it right here. To where? All right, there you go. Okay. Right inside the room. Use the box on my own. What does it, it say? It just said Rhode Island. Dude, it said Providence, it said Providence up in the Providence attic. Oh, that's where I'm from, my Providence, Rhode Island. Dude. Yes. 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 Oh my God. Tyler, dude. Oh my God. Levin? Levin? What is, what is that? Levin, I have no Levin. idea. I don't even know what It that pronounced means. it Levin. Dude, why? What is going on? Rhode Island, yes, when you said. It, where, it, <laughs> it said Providence earlier. Wow. So Providence, Rhode Island. Distance. 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 You came a far way yeah, here. We came a long way to me. Have you ever gone to Rhode Island once? Why would that come through? I don't mm. know. Tomb. Tomb. Bro, that is insanely intelligent, bro. And that's the thing about these spirits here, bro. They know things about you. Night. Night. This is gonna sound so weird. But, and it could be like eyes, you know what I mean? With all of these lights. Texas. Texas. It just, Wait, Texas. Oh my Hold God. On. Did you hear that voice? No. Well. I heard, I heard a woman's voice coming from this way. Another and, woman's and it, voice? It said Texas. It said Texas or well. Guys, if you don't know, I'm from Texas. All right, so let me let me say what I thought. Like, when before the Rhode Island, I thought I saw some type of shadow in the corner over there, and then there was like a blue light that went in back of you. What? And I don't know. It, it could be my eyes because, like I said, we have all of these lights. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. So it plays tricks on you and stuff like that. Why did I echo? Oh. There's a you, tad, there's a tad, but it sounded like your voice came from this way on that, on that. It sounded like something like literally finished my sentence. Mm -hmm. Is there a mimic here? Or like doppelganger? I'm gonna be honest. The only, the only thing I really know about this entity that as the owner has claimed it to be demonic. Maryland. It just said Maryland. 
is it is not nice at all. It is drawn blood on one of our friends. Like scratched so hard he has blood on his back. Like we've seen the pictures, it's insane. Jesus. And you will see it on the ceiling, on the floor, crawling. It is weird. This place is insane. And it's not out all the time. And tonight it really feels like it is. Blood. I love tea. I'm gonna turn the Mississippi down just a tad. Yeah. Cause it's going nuts right now. That's so weird that it says Rhode Island, Texas. I heard it again. If you're down there, can you say something? Holy hell. We think we can hear you. Can you try and say something louder? I definitely heard a woman's voice twice coming from the same area. Down There's so many women spirits here too. So it's like it's hard to tell who you're yeah, actually talking to. This it's really weird. liking us move around. That's what I'm saying. On Side. Side? Surprise. Side surprise. Is there a surprise waiting for us? Didn't you just say you think something's gonna build up to something? Oh my god, I did say that. And it just that. said surprise. Surprise. Like I it's like, <laughs> it built off what you just said. Like there's gonna be a surprise or something. That's not good. So was I right that it's gonna be quiet now, but it's gonna build up and something's gonna happen later? If I was right, either make a noise or make one of our equipment go off. That was a total voice, but it sounded male that time. Yep. Was it from that way? No, that way. Which the male way. side is right across this wall on both floors. I heard it from down there. But also linger. Linger. They're lingering on They're the side. They're lingering, dude, on the side. Here. Manifest. Manifest. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. So so what if we're creating this, right? Like what if we're the ones making like nothing happen right now because we're all anxious and everything? I mean that's how it though it goes, but I mean there's right. also a huge storm outside right now no. giving them this energy. Yep. No, but that's what I'm saying. So it's like because of how we're feeling, it's gonna, it's gonna be quiet right now, but then all of a sudden, all this energy is gonna come out of nowhere and just boom on us. And we're manifesting this to happen. I wanna ask more questions, I really do, because it's like weird. Yeah, keep asking, bro. All right, I wanna know whose voice are we hearing? Who's the female? What's the surprise that you have for us? Are we in danger? Is the mean spirit out tonight? If you're a mean spirit, what do you identify yourself as? If you want to hurt anybody, who would you want to hurt? Do you like any of us? How do you know where we're from? If there's anything left you want to tell me, say into this recorder right now. Okay. Why, why do you keep looking over Because there? I was checking to see if it was my hair or a shadow or something. I just watched something around that corner. I'm not even kidding. It looked like it looked like a black dress, like the way it flows at the bottom back in the like the really long time ago. Rounded that corner. It was very low, and it just rounded. And that's why I kept looking back to see if I my eyes were adjusting to the shadows or anything. That was super weird. Right when you were asking those questions, bro. Jesus. Did that say me? What's the surprise? Me. All right. I want to know whose voice are we hearing? Who's the female? What's the surprise that you have for us? Why do you sound like that, though? Are we in danger? Like, you, you know, it's like you like sound weird. All right. I want to know whose voice are we hearing? Who's the female? 
I think it says me. Yes, it yes, is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I'm, clear. Dude, I'm telling you. Yes. I'm telling you that thing is out tonight, bro. What does that say? It just said fresh. Fresh. Fresh meat. Her fresh to the spot. Exactly. Yeah. Fresh meat. All right. That's the thing that's really make itself known. I'll be in danger. It's the main spirit out tonight. I want to hear that. Oh, I want to know whose voice are we hearing? Who's the female? I slowed it down. Yes, yes it, it is. is. If you're a mean spirit, will you identify yourself as? If you want to hurt anybody, who would you want to hurt? Do you like your ego? How do you know where we're from? If there's anything left you want to tell me, say it to this recorder right now. That's so weird Super because weird. it like went off of like, it, but it like it, it like it went off of the things of like, yeah, I'm here and stuff like that, but nothing against any of us. No. Which, yeah. What did it did it say? Nothing. It else? just said roadway. Roadway. So I have no idea. It feels so bizarre. This does feel weird. I'm telling you, there are nights here where you can come here and that thing is not out. Hop it where it is actually not here and you could just sleep in the hallway and you were just talking to people And then Watch. there's other nights Where it's like this and you know, it's out and nothing else is really gonna talk porch 41 years I don't know, but I don't know bro. It does not feel good tonight. It really does not feel good tonight Also Tyler, I saw you were shaking while you were shaking. holding the I was. I don't know why and I do, I do want to say something. The first place you all went was bike. the attic, correct? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Bike, bike. There's a bike in Noah's room. The oh. little tricycle yeah. thing yep. that you rode there on. Is. But last time that we were here and we actually talked to that entity, it was right at the very start. We said, hey, because we heard a bang. And we said, if you are the demonic entity in the basement, stomp right now. And on the attic steps, boom, like immediately. And the first place we went was the attic. What would you say? Where should we go next? Like S second floor, men's se area. Second floor, men's area. Yeah, but if you are still drawn to doors, we should go to the kitchen Shade. after that. Shade. How are you feeling with uh, with the doors? Did it go away, or is it still there? She is a very emotional spirit. So if you are connecting with her on an emotional level, she's trying to yeah. contact you. Restored. Shade restored. My thing is, it's like now. If I'm really thinking about it, if my pull is to Doris, mm -hmm. her room didn't work, go to the kitchen, yep. which would be the next she, idea. Yeah. What's right next to the kitchen? Yeah. Where that thing hangs out. The basement. Yeah. No, exactly. Yeah. My thing is, is that like, I feel like if we go down there, whatever is there, it's going to push her out completely. And that's what I think. But it's like, what if the whole thing is to try and feel emotional to Doris to get me closer to where it likes to hang to out? To lead you down to there? To lead me down there. It could be. Yeah. No, that could exactly be what and it's And that's like. what is going through my head at the moment. Yeah. Like, dude, my leg has goosebumps right now. And it's like, I never get this into something like this. No. So you're, you're more being affected emotionally, right? Like sort of on the emotional level? I don't know. I'd like, say this so. This I mean, weird. Because you're feeling more like anxiety than you normally do. Yeah. Yeah. That's well, yeah. Emotion. Yeah. That's true. Because my personal belief with these evil entities is whatever is most vulnerable to you, they are going to target that. Like with Jake and yeah. Noah, they are scared of ghosts. So they're going to try to scare the hell out of them. Yeah. And then with like people like me and you, I'm very emotional. I'm a very emotional guy. And they will put a story in my head of something that happened to a specific person here and just constantly had that in my head. Dang, to maybe that's like the whole story thing. Like this Could thing be. has been playing games the whole time. Could be. Because Doris' story is sad, dude. It is sad. She was just dropped here yeah. by her family and then she was left and then and she just became the cook. Die. Literally yeah. die in this room right yeah. here. I thought I just heard something. Yeah, I thought I heard like a bang. And that's the rec room, right, for the woman? Yeah, rec room right there, and then it connects to the men's room as well. If you want us to go in the basement, so can you make weird. a noise? I just want to know, like, why, why is it just you two? You know, it's like, because I heard the women, like, the women scream, but, like, I was the only one who heard that. 
and then y'all are hearing completely different stuff than me. I don't know. I don't know, it affects people different ways. I have no idea. You wanna to move to the kitchen? You wanna to go to the kitchen? I don't know. Cause you gotta think, that's where she would have spent majority yeah. of her time. Cause she cooked for everybody. That door, that ringer bell, mm -hmm. she would ring that to let everybody know that the yeah. food's ready. Cause it's like, what are, what are the off chances that maybe she really is there and that you are actually being drawn towards her and it's not something trying to mess with you, yeah. you know? Yeah. So it's like, I feel like it would be worth it to at least try. All right. Well, obviously yeah. we're, obviously we're going downstairs at some point. Yeah. So yeah. let's just do it now. I mean, it's just, yeah, I don't know. Just keep in mind, this is where this thing thrives. Whatever evil entities out tonight, that's where it thrives. You want to know? Yeah. Yeah. So just, we just need to be careful. All right, guys, this is Doris. So we're in her kitchen now. Yep. Came here, try and figure out what's going on. We got right. this thing already on. Yep. And um, we put static and the trip wire is back there. This is where maybe they wanted us. So I think it's a good time to start. See yep. if they want to talk, yep. communicate. And I mean, awesome. the scariest part is that room right here is what, you know, you said the crawler thing is. I don't yeah. like that. <laughs> What I, the reason I wanted you to put the dead bell is because she used to ring the bell when food was ready. Oh. So what if she, that could have been a new device that like, oh, I recognize something like that. That's oh, true. Oh, interesting. All right. What the hell? Doris, if this is you, can you make that ring twice very fast? A ding, ding. Oh, look, look, look. Oh. It's standing right there. Right, right on our is that, side. Is that what that does? The picture? Yeah. yeah. To show Clayton, can you walk to the other side? Thank look, 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 look. Dude, that's sick. Right? Sometimes it'll go in a circle. Are you able to... Two, I just did it two. Oh, oh my <laughs> god, dude. Oh, no, it's right. It's going around. It's going around. Can you go in a circle for us? Doris, thank you so much. Keep going. Oh, look, 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 look. It's going around. It's going around. Yep, it is. Oh my god. It left. Doris wanted you down here, bro. Doris, if you wanted me down here, could you make that ring twice fast again? Really fast, two times. So the story I wanted to tell you, Tyler, that could correlate. What? You sound like a little whistle. No. Doris, is that you? Can you make another noise? That was weird, but what was the story? So basically the first time I was here, okay, first time I ever came here, it was, we were going to Stone Mansion, which is five minutes away from here, and Dan, the owner, let us in here just for a tour to walk around and stuff, because Jake no wanted to show me. And I didn't know anything about this place, no history, nothing. And as soon as we got here, Dan and Jake and Noah were walking us around, and I kept hearing a little girl crying. Like, I started crying when I was here during this experience. I know this is gonna sound crazy, I'm sorry, but it is super real and emotional to me. But I kept hearing her crying and it was from a distance because we were on the second floor. So I just like took off. Didn't know this building. I just took off and the crying got louder as I got in the basement. So I came down there, went all the way over here to the woman's side, went down and on that, the furthest room to the left, right yep. by the steps. You know the story about that, right? The little girl. No. So I got to that room and the crying like stopped and I started like bawling my eyes out. And I was like, Jake, what happened in this room? And he said, this is where that six year old girl got raped. Oh. By her step. I did, okay. And that was my first ever experience in this building, so that's why I'm saying, first time I was here, it was very emotional. Yeah. You're, you're hitting that emotional spot with you. So we're kind of having like a similar experience. Yeah, that's weird. Jeez, yeah, I forgot about that story. Yeah, it's rough, it's really rough. It gets really heavy down here in the basement. If you're still here with us, can you make the bell go off? Begin. 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 I was just thinking in my head, let's start the Estes. Really? Dead serious. Wow. Doris, do you want to do you want us to do a method where you can actually speak through one of us? We'll, we'll be a voice for you. I feel you're whispering. I didn't hear it. It was like like that. Like that. That's what I just heard. Okay. 
Okay. I do want to say it's not raining anymore either. No, it's no, not. It's so like, there's not going to be any. I, I feel like I hear like sprinkling almost. It could, yeah. yeah. But not like it was pouring. No, it was bad. Hell, do you want to get into the S's? I, I mean, think yeah. so. I, think something I want to try and go under this time. Yeah. I never do. I, I always go under. I something's wanting to talk to you or through you, yeah. bro. Yeah. So something's wanting, I think it'd be awesome. All right, let's do it. Um, we'll get set up, guys, and I'll show you the Estes. All right, guys. All right. All right, guys, Tyler's under. Now keep in mind, too, mm -hmm. he never does an Estes. Like, he never really? does Estes. Yeah, like it. Whenever we're like investigating and everything, it's always me that does it. So like, for him to want to go under, like that's that's new. Yeah. I'm back. Who are we talking to right now? Who's back? Marina. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Come on. Marina, this is your first time here, so this like... This is my first time here, so it's... Ugh. Yeah, I don't know. What about I, me? I swear to God, it just said demon. Now, this makes me think, what if whatever we were just talking to wasn't Doris at all? It made us get emotional. That's and, what I was doing about Ida. I know, I know. Were you trying Come to... Come now. Where do you want Marina to go? And what, demon comes now? Oh, maybe. Because also, like... On our channels, like we don't, we don't push demons unless it comes up on its own. Yeah, yeah, you know? for sure. So it's like, <sighs> yeah. I mean, that's the same thing with me, Jake, and Noah. Is we yeah. don't ever Game claim. On. <laughs> Game on. Pinch me. What do you mean, game on? He just said, pinch me. Me. What, game on with you? That's the fan. <laughs> yeah, I know, that's the fan. It's, it's creepy. That has gotten us many- Demon. Many. Again. Okay, if we are truly talking to a demon. I won't stop. You have to identify yourself right now. What demon are we talking to? Demon. We've already got that. Tell us your Ooh, name. That was weird. It goes, I will get you. Whoa. Pace. Did you just hear a, like an exhale? That was me. That was oh, okay, me. okay, okay. Where did you come from? Because there's no getting out. There's no getting out. Who are you talking to? Me. Whore. Whoa. Who did you just call that? It sounded like, that was weird. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't know, it, it sounded like, you know like the sound to Insidious? How that, like the music starts? Like the violin? The violin, that's yeah. what it sounded like. Ooh, ew, ew. No. That was weird. That dude. is super weird. That's weird. That's my, That's the movie that I say always creeps me out the Insidious most. Insidious is terrifying. Tell us why you're here. What is your motive? It sounds like a woman yelling. That's, that, Marina, that's the kind of the woman voice that we heard. It sounded like she was in pain. Mm -hmm. Are you hurting some of the spirits here? I'm watching you. Oh my God. Who are you? What's your name? Behind you. Are you in here? Dude, why does it sound so creepy? It says, can you see me? Right when we looked in there. Ew. Marina, that was right I've when we- never had a session like this. No, we can't see you. Oh, it's a really deep voice. I, haven't, I don't know what that said. I don't know how you all feel about religion on your channels. 
I mean, say whatever you okay. Say. In the name of Christ, we demand you. You have you to. Too. You too. You too. <laughs> the only people that are under. In the name of Christ, we demand you to identify yourself. You have to identify yourself to us right now. We know you're a demon. You won't believe this. Try us. Said again, behind you. What? Where, where behind us? I mean. Oh God. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just showing all angles where it could be behind us. I'm like, I don't even know. Like there? Right here? Demon. Again? Dude. Oh my I God. Mean, we have never, ever gotten demon in one of our Estes really? before. Really? No, never. We never have. Tell us where you came from. Where do you reside? Demon. It sounded like he was like happy about it. Demon. <laughs> this is actually, he said demon like six times. Like I'm not even kidding. Cause like, this is the thing. If you guys actually- Get out. But it sounded like a woman saying get out. Oh. Maybe Doris. It might be Doris. Us. Like if you guys actually Dude, watch our videos- It feels like something's like on my leg. I wish he didn't touch it. You don't have permission to touch any of us. It sounds like crying, like a female crying. Maybe, I don't know. Um, yeah, well, I was gonna say, like, if you guys actually watch our videos, you know that we, we don't ever talk about demons unless it's like actually brought up in the investigation on yeah. its own. So it's like, this happening, we've never done this before. We've never had this before. Like this, this is a first. I'm here. <laughs> I do want to apologize. <laughs> if it's because of me, I am sorry to both channels. I am so sorry. And then like, even, even the places where it's like, people say all the time, like, oh yeah, that, that one thing there, like that's a demon. It's like, we- Hello. It's like, we just graze over it. And it's like, if it calls itself that, sure. But it's like, if we, like, if we don't have it to where it says it on its own through whatever it does. Yeah. Are you scared? No. No, I'm not we scared. Are not. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm scared, Marina. No, I'm not scared. Oh my God. I want to know what you're doing. Why won't you tell us your name? Come here. Where? Alone. No. No, she's not going to be going alone. Come find me. No, I'm not going to come find you somewhere. Do it. No. Oh my God. Do it now. What the f... No, I'm not going to come find you somewhere. You I'm running. Come. You can come here. Hang on, let's listen, let's listen. Did you feel that? What was that? What? Did you hear that like... Was that the headphones? I, I don't know. I don't. It sounded close. It's like, guys, like open and close. You can hear it. Demon. That's like eight times now. I'm not even kidding. Are you the demon that resides Shit. in this building? Are you the demon that resides in the Randolph County Asylum? That would be the only entity that makes sense because you all are new. Yeah. It's trying to scare you. It said where you all are from, where you all live. Yeah. Trying to let it know that, or let you all know that it knows who you are. Oh yeah. It's like, it's trying to like, well, it was, it was hardcore provoking me just now. Yeah. Where do you want Marina to go alone? You're safe. Come alone. Dude, you know what? It's probably trying to like, get me to it's like no, no, no you're safe you can come along. yeah yeah do it where it's pretty vague what you're saying to us if you do want her to go somewhere specific you got to say it that was so freaky it went clayton what the hell Demon. Okay, this is insane. I feel like oh my god, I don't even know. Us. 
It, I feel like I, I don't feel scared, but I feel like it's trying. Play to. It. Yeah, it's not going to scare us. It's so you know what? You know what? It's saying my name. It's telling me to come out and come out and go alone and everything. And then I'm saying I'm, I'm not scared. Hi of you. everyone. You come here. I'm not scared of you. That wasn't the fan. What? That sounded like it was on the window. That was not on the fan. Right when he said hi, everyone. That sounded like Ethan. that. That sounded like the window tried to break. Oh God. I have never heard this many demons ever. Th that's what I'm saying. I know. I that's nuts. I'm watching those videos. You all don't really come in contact no, with demons at no. all. And like I said, if if it's my fault, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It's I'm very okay. sorry. <laughs> can't do it anymore. Holy shit. Tyler. Bro. What the fuck? So, okay, so what I was about to tell you before we heard the window was that... What happened at the window? Well, it sounded like it was like... Well, he said that it sounded like it was like breaking, like something was like cracking it. You hear the normal fan sounds, right when you said, hey everyone, it sounded like the sound went from up top all the way to the window and it sounded like the window tried to like break in. That was yeah. so loud. Right when you said, hey, everyone. Not that, right? No, that's, that's the normal that's fan. But um, so what I was saying was, it was provoking me, Marina, go alone, do this alone, blah, 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 go here, blah, 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 whatever. And then since I was saying like, no, I'm not going, I'm not scared of you, I switched to you. Mm -hmm. And started saying, you. Yeah. Dude, I've never had a session like that ever. No, we've never, <laughs> ever had something like that before. And like I told Marina, bro, I do want to apologize if it's because of, if it's because of me that these no, demons or demonic either. entities are coming through. Jesus Christ, dude. Don't even worry about it. Like, it's... Nothing? Did you ask any questions for Doris? No. We... It, it, it was just pushing out. It, all that was coming out was like, demon, demon, demon. Go along, go along, Marina. Are you scared? And we, we yeah, said... I feel like we shouldn't give in to it, but it's like, I don't know what to do. The, the main thing that I was trying to do was I was trying to say, hey... If you really are a demon, identify yourself, tell us what demon you are, where you reside, and then you would just come back and say, demon. demon. Like, we're like asking for a name, like, what are you? Say your name. Demon. Demon. Then it kept trying to isolate her, and then she was very strong and stood up to it, then it bounced over to me. Jesus yeah. Christ. So as soon as I stood up to it's it... It's freezing in here now. Oh yeah. God. Yeah, it's not a good vibe in here, bro. No. Like, as soon as I stood up to it and, like, stood my ground, it backed off of me and went straight to clan. Yep. Yeah. Jesus. And what makes me think it actually is this location's demonic entity is because every other one that me personally have come in contact with, it will like, it takes pride in identifying itself. This thing here does not want yeah. you to know what and it this, is. And this always has never wanted to? Never wants to identify it. It literally just says demon. That's all it says. Oh, and it kept telling us behind you, behind you. Did you see me? Look behind yeah. you. And that we're was like, super weird. Is it going off? No, no. we just looked no. behind there and that thing, and right when we looked in there first, you asked, Can you see me? Holy shit, really? Yeah. Right, yeah. yes, bro. This it was he insane. Said behind you, and so we're looking. We're looking in here, and then you go, Can you see me? Holy fuck. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Did the device go off the word bank, no. obviously? Nothing. Nothing? nothing? Not even so a dead nothing. Dog. Nothing no. went off once. And that's yeah. that's no, that's what I've personally. Oh my oh, lord. My, like, same thing on my legs. Like, yeah, look at my leg too. Good God. That's what like I was that, gonna that say. That just happened. Like, yeah, it's already gone. Anytime I personally come in contact with anything evil or demonic, it does not want to let itself known through devices. It literally wants to psychologically screw you up and try to manipulate you to go do stuff by yourself. Yeah. Every like, time. That's what it was just doing to me. It was trying to force me into it. And then, oh, and then it said, "No, you're safe." Yeah. Off of come alone. Yeah. Uh huh. Because nice. I was like, Marina's not going alone, and Marina was like, No, I'm not scared. I'm not going alone. And you said, Oh, you're safe. Come on, go alone. Yeah. It was trying to tell me that I was going to be safe. I'm like, I don't believe you. Jesus. Dude. Yeah, that was an insane Estes, bro. That was uh, nuts. I think that is the craziest Estes that we've had since Homestead. Uh, or honestly, I've never. Way crazier. Like yeah. that, that does not even compare to any other SS's we, that we have done. And I've watched your all's videos and I, you all really don't come in contact with no. demonic. This is the first all. time, that I, if this is what you're saying, this is the first time it's ever came out like this yeah. at all. Yeah. I've never... We you know. have never, ever come across something that's like demon, 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 demon. Like, cause we don't do that, you know? No. Yeah, that's fine. I'm telling you, if this place, if the demonic entity wants itself known, you're going to feel it the entire night. As soon as you get to the building, you're like, ooh. Something's not right. And then other days when I don't want to like be known, you're talking to Doris, you're talking to Ida, Noah, 
all the other spirits that are in the building. And notice tonight we haven't talked to anybody. Anything, no. anything. I mean, all we got was the name Noah, but nothing communicated in Noah's room. And it felt weird in that attic, dude. It felt weird. Or what if that was its way? We know he, I swear, it heard us say that we were going to start from top to bottom. So what if yeah. it forced out the word Noah to start us to come down? That's a good point. Yeah. Yeah, because I mean, you all told out your plan yeah. out open. Yeah. That's exactly, that's exactly what happened. Yeah, I think it, it knew that we were going to start from the top and end up down here. And so it was waiting for us. So it said Noah to get us to start our journey back down. Jesus. But it's like... I'm super confused on why everything was going off. At first we had the static dome. The dead bell was going crazy. And now it's just silent. Notice when the spirits that are not the demonic entity here, they yep. love the devices. I actually think in the beginning we were talking to Doris. And then Gone. we open up Estes and that thing comes through. None of the devices have been off. And even you, you came through on Estes and said a woman voice said, get out. What if that was Doris screaming yes. at that demonic entity? That's like, what Jesus. Was saying. Doris was telling us to get out because she knew that it was here. Jeez. Yeah, because the, the people here, like Doris and the kids, they fear this thing and they don't like it. Like they yeah, I mean, hate why it. Why would they? No, I, I, exactly. I don't know. Where is that device, the obvious thing? It's right here on the counter. And it didn't go off once. It did not say a single thing, bro. Last thing it said was two years, and that was right before we did the S's. Yep. And Jeez. then it has not said anything else. Do we do anything more in the basement, you think? Or should we just go to the second floor? I would, I think we should hang out in the hallway for at least like 10 yeah, On the second minutes. floor uh, men's hall? On, on down here. Down here? Yep. Because that's another hallway that you can see stuff at the ends. The freaking door will, might close. You just never know, bro. The okay. hallways are huge in this place. So then we'll go down this hall right here? Yeah. Okay. All right. <gasps> Dude. As soon as we freaking came up with the plan to go in the freaking hallway. What? Now that, that goes was off. I just said 13 years. That is the first. What was that? That might be thunder. Hopefully thunder. <laughs> that, <might be> thunder. <laughs> that rumbled the whole building. Yeah. That was probably thunder. Dude, 13 the years. whole time, nothing goes off. Wait and a then second. Bell what? I don't think, okay, hang on. I might be getting my history wrong. I need to check this. But the girl who got sexually assaulted down here, I don't think she was six. I think she was in the range of 11 to 14 when it oh. happened. Is that where we go? We could hang down out in the hallway, the left side, or we could go to the right where Ida sadly off, like, oh, off yeah. herself. The self. 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 Ida did it herself. Yeah. Right when we brought up Ida, bro. Damn. So y'all want to go to the left or right? It's really up to you all. Whichever one y'all want to do. I think Ida. Right side? Yeah. I don't yeah, know. If something changes, then we flip it, you know? But. Yep, that's fine. I want to clean this just oh, to yeah. maybe it might rile up some activity down here. Because this is what Doris used to ring when the food was done. Sick. God. The way that it still works, too. Yeah, I don't understand it. But then again, this place only closed down 18 years ago. Right. I feel worse here. I don't feel good at all in this room. I feel worse here. Yeah, it's not a good feeling this way. Thinking DR60. Yeah, let's do it, bro. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be cold. Okay. All right. Whoops. All right, Ida, or whoever else wants to speak, we have this. Whoa. I heard that bang. I heard. Okay. Wait. I didn't hear a bang. I oh, heard, I heard like a, a boom. I heard a boom. Just like that. Oh, I heard like a thump, like a boom. I didn't even hear anything. <laughs> All right. All right, let's reset that though. Yep, yep, yep. Just All in right, case. It looks good. It hasn't done anything. No, no. All right, Ida. Or whoever else wants to speak, we have this. I heard, okay. Wait, I didn't hear a bang. Oh, I heard a boom. I heard a boom. Yeah, like that. I'm gonna slow it down. I 
Yeah, like that. Oh, I heard about it. Oh, my God. Oh, I hate that. Good result. Good result. Good result. Good result. Good result. Good result. Uh, your light. Whoa. Hang on. What's it doing? It just said mist. You're okay. Is it supposed to pulse blue down? Huh? Down strip? Like it's off right now. Is it supposed to do that? It, it got drained. Really? It, I was just hearing some of the loudest sounds down this way. That's why I like stopped. Can you make a loud noise for us if I just heard you? Maybe we do just sit in the hallway, just all of us. I'm telling you, the hallways you hear everything. All right, let me grab the DR. Again, we have this recorder. If you come up, you can speak into this, we might be able to hear you. Whether you're the demon, Ida, Doris, anybody can come speak. If there truly is a demon here, what's your goal? What did you want with Marina specifically? You need to tell us your name. So what is it? Can you come closer to us? Are you coming closer to us? And that's not the fan because it was not making sounds no, like that. No, it wasn't making any sound it's at not. all. What? It sounded like something was real close that time. Who are we hearing at the end of the hallway? Say your name as loud as you can. If you truly are a demon, we're protected by God. We have white light surrounding all of us. We are protected and you do not get to have any of us alone. And I hope you understand that. You cannot hurt us. Sounds like it's coming from both sides now. Mm -hmm. How many of there are you down here in the basement right now? How many? When you said game on, what did you mean by that? You said that on Estes? Home. 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 Is this your home? Just to any of the spirits who went through something here, the spirits who were alive, we don't mean any negativity towards you. Anything that we're trying to call out is towards this demon who is wanting Marina alone or saying Clayton's name. I, I don't want you to think that any of this is disrespect to you. Shoulder. You got tapped on your shoulder as soon as we came down here. Oh my God, you're on the way down the hallway. I did right there. And you're the one talking right now. It reminded, it like remembers you by tapping you on the shoulder. 
We mean no disrespect to anyone who was living. And it sounds like it's coming from that room, yep. to be honest, exactly. when it's on this yeah, other right side yep. where I felt it. Yep. And you know what died down? The noise is on that side. Uh-huh. All right, maybe we end it and listen back. Okay. Because you got to think, if it didn't travel directly towards us, there's a whole other ass hallway that wraps yep. all the yeah. way back around. Japanese? What? <laughs> I don't know. I got the Japanese recorder. That's the only thing I can really think of. I'm gonna play normal speed for now. Yep. Did you say I'm a demon? I heard demon. I heard demon. I slowed it down. There's something, but... Right? Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Yep. Did you say it was me? I mean, pretty dry. Yep. We got demon, and then it it was. Thought I was hearing stuff. Oh. Wow. You you were. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Who that is so loud. That is not the fan. The fan cannot be heard from that far away. What if, noise. what if we just go super quiet? Okay. We'll, we'll leave the DR60 going, but we like we let it go for a few minutes. Yep. Okay. okay. What was that? What the hell? Oh, what? That sounded like a door. <gasps> that was a bang. 
Yeah, that was huge. That was above. Did you hear that yes, above as yes, well? Yes, yes, yes. I swear that was like a door opening or closing. No, somewhere. seriously. I kind of, hang on, I want to go check. I'm going to go check real quick. Take the night cam. Yeah. I want to go see if that big ass door shifted at all. How are you feeling? I, I mean, I feel good, but I'm just like, what is going on? Okay, this big door is good. So I thought that might have been the door scraping, but it was not. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna stop the recording. So, you know, how they've been saying, like our friends have been saying that it's like, when it's a spirit, when it's a ghost, like a, of a person, then they use the equipment and everything. Mm -hmm. But none of our equipment has been being used except for occasionally the dead bell. But yeah. Everything that we're hearing is noises and sorry, sorry, sorry. things that we're feeling. Yeah. And that's exactly what it's supposed to be. And it's what, that's what it's saying it is. Yeah. That's why I love this location so much because it really lets you hone in on like your physical body as equipment here. Like you really get to truly feel the paranormal here. Yeah. Oh, okay. I feel it. All right, let's listen to this just yeah. to see. Yeah. Dude, I wonder if the door is, you can hear it on there. I doubt it, but I'm really that was hoping. so loud. I'm telling you, if you just sit in hallways in this place, you will hear the craziest shit ever. It is insane. It's insane. I know my name. Did it say, I want you, Marina? Oh it literally my said, god. It literally said, I want you, Marina. <laughs> You can so clearly hear my name. Yeah, the marina's delayed. Oh, that is a voice saying my name. Yeah, I rewind it again. Here, let's listen to the whole thing. Yep, yep, yep. I mean, unless. It sounds like it's trying to say your name, and then it says marina. Yeah, like stutters marina. on the ma. Right, the want here. is really loud. Yeah. It's like, I want you. Yeah. Oh my God. Go, go back for the whole thing really quick. All right, this is the beginning. Here, I'll even slow it down. Whoa. Okay, hang on. Now that we heard it slow, you know how me and you heard like the delay, ma? I think I hear alone. Oh! I oh. want you alone, Marina. Okay, let's do it one more time. Oh. Alone. It pronounces alone. And then it goes, Marina. Wow, and that's exact. that correlates that's with your essence. That's exactly what the essence said. That's intelligent. Communication, dude, between two that different is, methods. That's crazy. I, I don't think I've had that before where it's like our Estes lined up with something else that I said that directly. That, that just shows you how intelligent just, this is. That just like blew bro. my mind. I have it normal now. It says it again! It says it yeah. again! Yes! What? It, wait, does it just yeah. keep saying I think it, it literally over repeated over that the again? entire time we were here. you alone, Marina. I want you alone, Marina. It just keeps going. I think it said it like four times. Bro. Mm -hmm. 
Do say it again. That was my footsteps. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. I think right. it repeated the same thing like four or five times. Over, I over, you over and over again. Wow. <laughs> you're, you're not getting her alone. I'm telling you that right now. Here's the thing that also is kind of weirding me out. So it's like, you you both still like feel on edge, right? Like you both still feel bad. Oh yeah. I'm gonna be 100% on it. It's kind of subsided a little bit. Definitely a little bit, definitely in. a little bit, yeah. Like, but, it, it's, but it's still, still like there. lingering in my in my body. So my thing is, what's weirding me out is it wants me alone so <gasps> badly. I heard that too. You heard that? Yes. It was like a oh, exactly, that's exactly. Oh, right over you talking. I didn't hear it. That was huge. I didn't mean to interrupt you, no. but no, so keep okay. going. Um, why is it that I'm the only one who's been fine all night? And it's, I'm the one that it wants alone. It's like, why do you guys feel bad? But it's like, I feel fine. Maybe it's because we feel bad and we have that extra guard up, even though we're, you know what I mean? Yeah. And like, you're kind of flat toned right now. Well, cause it's like, if it's manipulating with our feelings, of course it's gonna want you guys scared cause you're not gonna wanna be here if you're scared. But if I feel fine, Right. Okay. That sounded like an actual door rattling. I do not mean to keep cutting you off, but the more you talk, it seems like the more angry it's getting. Like you saying you're not going to go alone and saying what it's been doing. Yeah, I'm not doing what it's asking. Yeah, imagine like, like say for instance, you all did do solos when you all filmed together. Yeah. You would be perfectly fine all night. Like, it yeah. seems like you would have the one mindset out of all three of us that you're like, oh yeah, I can go alone. Yeah, I'm no, good. no, yeah, for sure. Like, if this wasn't happening and like y'all told me like, well, why don't you try a solo? I'd be like, okay, yeah, we could do a solo. And then that demon would be getting exactly what it wants. And there's no telling what would happen. Because last time my friend was here, Chris Ball, his friend got scratched so bad on his back that it literally drew blood. Like we have the picture that we can send you all for the video. Jeez, dude. Like honestly, I am so glad that we made this decision to have you come tonight because Say if this went in the direction that it did, I just don't know how different this would have this would be. Yeah, no, I appreciate y'all letting me come on. Glad. This has been insane because this building is for y'all's first time here. This is not the vibe you would want to have. Like coming in here, not having any knowledge on how the paranormal actually is in this building, because it could have got very dangerous. Moved in that doorway right there. I swear. Sorry. I didn't like no, no, no. You're good. Bro. Obviously, I'm trying. What the fuck? How, how low was it? Look to the left. Yeah. Oh, it, it past the doorway, I swear. Like there's a, there was a, do you see something? I actually just saw over? something, yes. Is it? Is it looked it? like it went up the steps though. Like right when you were talking, it looked like it went up like right below the fire alarm, red thing on the wall. It looked okay. like something darted up. Like did. No, I didn't. No, that was not me. No, it couldn't have been. No, dude, it was. It was dark. Yeah, it had masks. It would have been. Huge yeah, because like there. even us, like you can see us, like. No, that's it, it was, was. It was full dark. black, dark. It had substance. It looked like. Sorry, dude. There's like so much shit that's bringing us like all over the place right I now. I know. I know. I don't. I just don't get it. This place sharpens your mind throughout the night. Like the longer you're here, the more you just can't like keep up with everything that's going on. I say we just go second floor, second and that's floor. that's the only yeah. spot that we have left. Yeah, yeah. And we, I think on the second floor we need to do exactly what we're doing right now. Maybe even set up a little bit more equipment. Yeah. Because some things on the second floor they'll like show themselves on this side, and then other things will show on this side. So if we set like right in the middle, we'll be in the middle of everything. I'm starting to get like anxiety shakes. Really? I mean, look at your goosebumps all over I you. I know. They haven't left. Are you good? Okay. <laughs> that's cr That's insane. That's actually insane. I have not heard consistent noise like that in this basement ever.
That was, I think, the shutters. That had to have been the fan because of the metal. Yeah, you can hear it. Yeah. That one. But everything else, it didn't sound like No, that. no, it didn't. Like, you heard the metal creak right there. Yeah, yeah, everything that one you can hear. Like, you can hear the scratch almost. I say we just move up to the second, up second floor and see what happens. Let's do it. But then, you all right? Yeah. All right, second floor. So, like what we were saying, just set up in the hall. Yeah. Right here in the middle, I'm thinking. Yeah. There we go. Yep. Did you hear that? What the yeah. hell is that? Was that like the... Uh, yeah. Okay, that's what we were telling you all about earlier. There is a residual energy of a mechanic who used to work on the building and you will hear him working on wood like a chainsaw. <laughs> that was that? It scared the hell out of me last time I was here and then I learned about that spirit here. The mechanic, you can hear him working on the building like he was. Shh, shh, shh. Is that rare? Do what? Is that common or rare? I mean, it's happened the past few times we were here, but like the first like seven times I was here with Jake and Noah, we never heard that. It just recently became like a constant thing. That's fucking scary. No, it's terrible. <laughs> I know. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. So, so you'll hear it from here, and then in the woman's side rec room door that goes outside. Is it wind though on the door? That one down there, there is a seal that's broken that sometimes you will hear the wind. But when you actually hear the chainsaw like sawing, that one was weird. That it was in this room, like that last one. Oh. This door seal does not have an issue at all. It's this door. That one right here for this room, I can tell you right now, is this door. So that, that one, I can say, but the first ones that we heard exactly was a saw. Yeah. Yep. Oh. Yeah, no, that, I was up here on solo the first time I heard it on live, and it scared the shit out of me. I was like, what am I hearing, dude? <laughs> I didn't know what to say. That's actually so scary sounding. Yeah. It's just the mechanic that used to do work on the building and now in the afterlife he's still here doing work. Like so. Because all, that's the only thing I can say is that one, just hearing that part. Yeah. But there was a saw. There was 100% a saw. You'll hear the difference between the wind. Yes. The wind kind of sounds like, it's like a, I don't know how to describe it, like a bubbly type thing. Mm -hmm. that you can exactly what we just heard right there, yeah. but it was quiet. The saw, you can literally hear like it rev up, just like cut it, yeah. 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 See what I mean? Yes. That's the wind. That was the saw. Yeah, that was the saw. I don't know if you guys can hear it's the difference. It's a totally a higher pitch. Like the, the, the wind is like the... And then... It's like this mic should saw, pick it up. I'm but hoping the saw is like... Yeah. It's different. Yeah, it's a higher it pitch. Is. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that is something you definitely gotta get used to, to hearing that. Now let's ask this question, right? Because we came up here off camera and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Was that door open? Yes. Okay, yes, it was. was. It was. Okay. Yep. If anybody's here that can hear us, though, can you make yourself known? You didn't hear that? Mm -mm. I didn't hear it this weekend. Oh. I heard it. I totally yeah? heard it. I was going to say, it sounded like... Eep. That. 
You right there? What? Nothing? I'm not hearing that. Like personally, I'm I'm not disregarding anything you are. I'm not hearing that at all. Can you make another noise for us? Now see, that's the wind. It's like yeah. deeper, yeah. bassier. Yeah. Can you make a loud squeak noise? Okay, you heard that? I heard okay, that one, okay. yes. I heard that, that one. That's what it was. And that was on command. I don't know yes. what that was, but that was intelligent. Thank you. I'm still going. Are there birds in here or something? No. No. There's no window that's like broken for any animals to get through or anything. It's like a cart sound. Yeah, yeah. Oh God, yeah. Wheelchair. Right. Wheelchair's oh, right upstairs. Wheelchair's it's right upstairs by the door. Oh my God. What if it's moving? Is the attic door open? I left it open. <gasps> it is, it is I open. I left it open. Dude, what if that's the wheelchair moving? Rolling, oh my God. If you're moving the wheelchair, make that squeaking noise again. Move it again. Dude. What if we try this uh, DR60 session? Yeah, let's try it. I'll turn this off so there's no contamination or anything. Alright. What's that squeaking noise that we're hearing? Can you tell me who's cutting the wood? Who's using that saw? Is that the wheelchair moving upstairs? Is yeah. the judge upstairs? Did anything follow us from the basement? If there's a demon- Oh, oh okay. So sorry, Jesus I just cut Christ. it. Alright. I'm <laughs> sorry, I was- we can ask it again. Keep your question. Yes. 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 Do we need to go check that? Do you know how to go back? Trying to figure it out. Something. It's. I felt like there were multiple responses that we didn't really. I pick can't out. pick out. Yeah. The only thing I understood was the yes for the yeah, wheelchair. Oh, yes. So clear. But then here, um, play it back. It sounds like it says yes, and then like blah 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 moving. What the hell was that? That was a huge bang. That was the mm. loudest one we've heard all night. I almost wonder if that was the door. Downstairs? Yeah. There's a possibility, I'm not gonna lie. Cause that, it sounded like it was movement and then the bang. Boom. It's making noise in the attic and the basement. Uh-huh. 
Are those footsteps? That yes. wasn't you moving your foot? No. Nope. That was boom, boom. I literally thought it was something I, over nope. here. No, he didn't move at all. Those are footsteps. Walk again, let's hear you. Walk closer to us. Play it, play it back again because I, I feel like it says something after yes. The demon. The yes, demon. I, the yes, demon. It says yes. The demon did. You you reacted as soon as yes. I started to say it. Yes, it's moving. <laughs> yes, it's moving. Yes. The demon. The demon. The demon. <laughs> That's crazy. That is insane. That was weird. I'm sure that was a car, but that sounded different. Like the Well, it was two sounds. I think that's what, it was the car, and then there was something down there. Semi. Okay, okay, okay yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did something follow us from the bait? That was so clear. The oh demon. my God. You wanna do another DR60 and ask your question? Cause we can yeah, even yeah. ask where it wants us to go. I, th I thought that that was the saw. Who's here? Ooh. Still upstairs in the attic. Yep. We left the light on up there anyway, so we need to go back. You wanna, do, you wanna go do a quick DR60 up there? And then while we turn the light off, then come back down? Let's do one more here first. Okay. All right. If the demon's here, why did you follow us? Clear as day. Alright, I wish whisper clear before that. But clear as day, there was loud footsteps. Step, bro? If the demon's up here with us, where do you want us to go? Again, the song. <sighs> Two distinct sounds. You can hear them both on your camera. Yeah. You're not hitting any of the equipment. So speak to us. What is it that you want? Dude, this feels like Texas, like, Chainsaw Massacre. Massacre. Yeah, Leatherface is outside, bro. Oh, <laughs> that's what that feels like. Oh, my God. That was insane. Oh, yeah, I just whispered, oh, my God. What's with the flies now? Where did the Dude, flies Dude, where did all the bugs come from? There were no bugs the I mean, entire night. What they say, demons attract their exactly. flies. And I hate to say stuff like that, but it's so true. And you know what's weird? I hate to say it, but Marina, they are circling you. Ah, uh, yes! Like they have been landing on your head, yes. your light, everything. That, it's super weird. And you're the one that it's targeting, like saying your name. It wants you alone. Oh, I just felt a tap on my shoulder. I don't know if that was a bug, but... Did you just touch Marina? Let's listen back. 
Shit's getting weird, bro. It's, it's, it's like nice. getting weirder than it was before. Yes, it goes yes. And it was right. Did you touch right. Marina? Yes. yes. Wow. Wow. Was that the last thing? That was it. Oh my god. I'm trying to get the anxiety shakes again already. That was one of those voices that like you feel that through your core. Yes. Like that was on the mic. Jesus. You good? Yeah, I'm just getting the shakes again. We can call it. I mean, it's been a night, and it's okay to call it. Whatever we're contacting, you have no permission to make Marina feel this way. You have made your presence known. Now back off of her. Dude, I'm shaking my camera. Yeah. This is this has been a lot. It's been a heavy night. There's been. A lot of responses. Yeah. And like And we don't want to put you through something that is just gonna to be too much. Yeah. Like I, I feel fine. Like seriously, I feel fine. It's just like It's the energy. That's that's yeah. exactly what you're feeling. It's all of the energy around this whole place. That's why right. I know you're shaking. Let's call it. Let's call it. Because I don't want you to... We still have two more spots. Yeah. We got a lot. We'll just close ourselves off to it now. Yeah. You see things all the time about demonic activity and where people will show things to that level. Tonight, what just happened was what I'm going to say is demonic i've never had an investigation work the way that that one just did and i mean it even got to um to where you, you're back to shaking which you haven't been from I almost day one of ghost yeah. hunting oh, that was my first investigation and so, i it's been over a year and i haven't had that it's been over a year i mean guys we've had things off of like spirit talker or you know things just quick quick little demon or devil or something like that tonight that was activity that I've never seen before, and I can't wait to actually myself go back and rewatch what happened on the Estes. Now, you Clayton, won't believe it. Clayton, you see this, and you, yeah. you've been here. You you know what goes yeah. on in this house, and it's like that's what like you guys witness here at this place, yeah. and it's just so mind blowing to see it on our end because, like I said, you just heard we don't get stuff I like know. this, like. Dude, it is absolutely it, This insane. is not the normal for us at all. No, it's not normal 
Yeah, you want to know what's great? It's not normal for the building either, which is just very unfortunate that you all came in contact with the demonic entity that's here. Because like I said, there's some days where you come in here and you could literally fall asleep purely lights off because yeah. you just talk to Doris, the kids, the nice spirits, and that evil thing just doesn't come out that night. Dude, that was like my 11th time here tonight, and that was like the second time I've actually come in contact with that demonic entity. Really? Yeah. Because, I mean, it was directly talking to us yeah. in oh, multiple like, ways. Like what you guys said, it came at you, it tried then coming at you, yep. and then I just couldn't listen to it anymore. I mean, with what it was saying, it was just so creepy sounding. I've never heard that before, ever, on a spirit box. Yeah. Yeah. Like, whenever we've done Estes's, like, it's always very, like, casual conversation. I have never been, like... I've never heard an Estes like that between us. We've never done that before. No, no. It has it's never been like that. Completely out of the ordinary. Never been like that. And then the Estes correlated directly to a DR60 yeah. session 20 minutes yes. later. Yes. Yeah. The exact same thing. And I mean, just the sounds. Like, I hoped so bad that you guys were able to hear those sounds because there, there was no explaining that. Like, the wind, I can try and explain that to you. The saw sounds, I mean, no guys. <laughs> It's four o'clock in the morning. No one is cutting wood. No one's sawing anything. It's like, no. I have no idea. We came here to Randolph no County Infirmary. We had a huge lightning storm. We had to have Clayton come because this place is just so off the rail. Yeah. So it's like, what is going on? There's so much more story and it, we, we didn't get any of that with, you know, the people who like, you know, died here. Maybe we did a little bit. I don't know, but it's like, there is so much here. And what we got is just so dang <laughs> spooky. It's insane, Clayton, what, bro. what is this? I'm telling you, bro. Randolph County Asylum will literally change your entire respect of the paranormal. That's all I can say about the building, Dude, bro. I'm seriously, dead ass. Seriously, seriously. Guys, this is one spot to where I say if you come here, be careful because, we'll, like, like It'll what Clayton you. said. And exactly. It'll get it's, to you. It could get to you. It could get to you, or it could not. So. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about this video. Absolutely insane. I don't know I mean, if, if we got that activity, if we would have been able to do it by ourselves. No. That, that was. If we got that without playing, I'd be gone. <laughs> oh, my God. Guys, so that's going to be Randolph County Infirmary. I know we're laughing right now and stuff like that, but it's literally because of everything. Over. Yeah, yeah. Like, that's what it is. It's like, we're just glad that we can now just like kick back, ground ourselves, and because me and we're sleeping here. <laughs> what, what are we yeah. doing? What are we doing? Maybe we're just going to stay in that con I have no idea. Dude, but, I'd be down to just stay in there. <laughs> just like, yeah. So, I, I've never slept here, but on the night that that demonic entity is out, I don't know if I would leave that common area. I, cause, yeah. I don't, don't want to be upstairs where we no. just were. No. Where you just ended the video? God. Yeah, no. yeah where Texas Chainsaw Massacre is going to happen to us. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. All right, let's end the video. Check right. M out. Go over there to our channel. Obviously, go show Clayton Appreciate some love. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you all for having and, um, me. Can't wait to collab again. Clayton, because Clayton wasn't supposed to be here tonight. I wasn't, bro. But, Came in the middle of a thunderstorm. But <laughs> it, it needed to happen. Clayton was available. And, dude, again, thank you so much. Absolutely. Thank you all for having and, me. I love this place, bro. Dude, that's it. Randolph County. I know I probably said that already three times. But it's because it's just crazy. I'll see you guys in the next one.